my name is ankush and today i'm making a video about oil painting if you're new to my channel uh, which you are probably new to uh, you would know that uh, if you're new you should know that this channel is all about drawing painting and creative things so um let without further ado let's begin painting Okay, before we get into painting, for the people who have been watching, I have to say, I haven't uploaded in a while. Yeah. Anyways, let's just ignore that and let's continue. So today I'm going to be talking about oil painting while working on my oil painting. So I started this one a month ago. So by the way, oil painting according to me is one of the most versatile mediums. It it allows you to blend so well and it stays like wet for so long and i really love that so and but the only problem is it's not very convenient you see watercolor and acrylic you can just mix it with water and thin it well oil paint is a problem you can't just mix water because it's oil so you need to use like chemicals and thinners which have really bad smells and they can kill if you swallow them so you don't want a 3 year old come into your room and drinking right so anyways i'm going to show you what i'm working on and i'm going to show you my progress so far this video is not like to teach people oil painting this is just to show how i'm doing and an example if you want to see how to do oil painting ask me in the comments or you could just um check out the videos yeah so guys, so far this is my painting. I'm not done with it. So I started this about a month ago. Sorry for that hand there. Um, and I'm going to work on it for a little. Uh, right now I'm just going to be working on the um, ocean right here. I'm going to pick up some... Yeah, so let's add. Basically, highlights. Oh, blur. Focus. There we go, sorry I, I had to go, um, yeah I'm back. Oh, the camera keeps going blurry. Is that even a word, blurry? Okay, I'm gonna mix a little blue with white, Chinese white actually. Let's see, I think this needs a little... It needs to look like water. There. 
and the sky notice how different the sky tone is from this yeah oh, let's just add a little bit to this clouds I need the clouds to look like they are real I don't want them to look like a block of white and a block of something else I just need to make subtle changes oh that's a little too much okay no problem just work it in let's take a little more white there we go that should be enough That's good. I'm gonna just take more white and fill it. Slightly changing the hue of the cloud. But just I just wanna make it so that it doesn't appear like a white block. Okay. I just wanna make it a little bluish. And it fades into white right here. There. Is that about it? By the way, this is just gonna be a short, short video. And it's gonna end a little soon. Okay. Um, so guys, enough of painting. Let me show you the supplies I use for painting. Okay guys, so first I want to show you guys my painting equipment, not my brush equipment. Let's see that. So basically I bought this from Amazon.com. Um, uh, this is all paints from Castle Art Supplies. It's really good and I like it a lot. Uh, and these ones right here are my old ones. They're from Camlin. You know, you can find it in India. Easy thing. Um, yeah, so these ones. Let's just see how big this is. Oops. <laughs> okay. Um, this is... This is 12... Oh, oops. 12 ml. 12 milliliters, that is. Um, and let's compare it with this. This is 9 ml. That's right. Big difference. Um, and these are much more hues and they're much better. So I just took these ones just in case I need more hues. And I really needed raw umber. That is. Yeah. Okay, guys. Now let's move on. Oh, yeah. I forgot to show you. I went up to a supply, like a... A store that has art stuff and like crafty stuff and I picked up two huge tubes I thought I might need them um, I picked up this um, Dale Rowney focus why does it take so much time to focus okay it's a Corelli um, hue just takes so much time to focus and it's the graduate oils. Yeah, now you can see. Oh, come on. Yeah, it's the graduate oils right here. And it's 38 ml. And the other color I have got here is permanent magenta. Again, from De La Rowney graduate oils. It's again 38 ml. And now I'm going to show you my brush equipment. Um, pause it right there. All the magic lies be beneath this. I mean, inside this. Uh, it's got like a zip thing. That's quite good. Oh, excuse me. I'm just opening it. It's so hard to open with one hand. Ah.
death. Oh yeah. This, this is a you. Uh, if you if you're wondering why this brush looks weird, it's because it's a fan brush and it's wet right now. Anyway, this is a filbert, a gigantic filbert. I thought I made need it. This is a filbert. This is a filbert. This is a bright, a uh, bright, flat, angular, angular. I'm not sure what this is. Let me just see this way. So basically, I'm I'm pretty sure I know what this is. So I think what happened was this was supposed to be a flat, and then suddenly the hairs got loose right here, and then came and popped up. Yeah. Well, either way, it's easy and it's useful to make trees. Well, I'm not sure. Maybe it could be a special brush. Uh, then this one is a really small round, like really thin. And this is a round. This is a this is a liner. Oh, it's a bit okay. Liner. This one is a small round again. This is a, a fan brush. Yeah. Now I'm gonna take you and show you the thinners, basically the things that you use to thin the paints. And I'm also gonna show you the mediums. So this is the main thinner that I use. It's purified, oh sorry, it's distilled turpentine. This right here is painting varnish. And this basically, after you finish a painting, you don't want it to like, you know, when oil paint dries, it doesn't truly really dry. If you scratch the surface, it'll be wet. So therefore, you need uh, this to create a la layer over the paint so that you can't scratch and remove the paint. Then there's this one. So this is purified linseed oil. You can use this as a medium. And you can also use it to level brush strokes. This one you can also use to clean your brushes. Okay guys, unfortunately it's time to end the video. This was a pretty short video. I promise I'll upload more often and I will make better videos. Um, sorry for the bad quality, I literally like just started my third video. so. Sorry if it was hard to watch. Anyways, uh, leave a like, subscribe, and comment if you like the video. Um, bye!